cetera. But uh, certainly. Uh, all right, man. Fuck all that, man. Speaking of aliens, bro. We had a sighting. It's a whole fucking alien right here. What the fuck is going on with Doja Cat, man? Them long ass titties, that fucking pointed ass forehead. What the fuck is going on with her, man? She been batshit crazy recently, man. Doja got some shit going on, man. She dissed the fans talking about, like, they wanted to call themselves kittens. She told them to get a life. She was like, yo, if, 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 you, if you could call yourself a kitten, you need a fucking job. She violated her fans. It's so crazy because, uh, you know, I think people could see signs of how she's acting now before she blew up. She was always odd. So it's, it's, it, it's improbable for me to just say, oh, it's drugs. I think this has always been her. She was always, you know, hanging around all these motherfucking, um, what's the name of those chat rooms called? She was hanging around those little white racist chat rooms. And um, that was what she was into. She, she's into a little bit different things than most people would like. However, um, she blew up. And I don't know. I can't tell if it's depression or like she hates. Like there's some people just that hate that uh, the idea of even what beauty is. And that, that get perpetuated through entertainment. Doja Cat actually looks attractive when she's really done up. I think that she's going out of her way to showcase some of the worst sides because she's probably, I, I don't know why that is, but she hates, she hates this idea of maybe like perfection that comes along with, you know, being such a star or like Hollywood or being whatever, whatever. Um... Yeah, you know, I never believe in some of them ritual type shit, but like, if there was anybody who would probably do some shit like that, I think it's Doja Cat. She still got a shit ton of fans, though. Or maybe it's just fashion. Look at this shit. She says, I can't trust no gnat. Okay. I don't know. She she, she 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 acts pretty odd to me. But for whatever reason, I still don't think it's drugs. What do y'all think it is? So I said she got that Stephen A. Smith hairline. Yeah, she does. Most of these chicks do. Them lace fronts be be having a toll on them, man. Edges stop edging. You know what I mean? All that little fake baby hair shit. The industry got her. She's possessed. Possessed by who? She's a test tube baby? I believe at a certain point, what we're going to watch is Doja Cat check into rehab or... Check into some institution for depression. I think she's going through some stuff. Um, it's kind of interesting that she's still able to keep up a career and kind of go through these episodes or what we think is episodes. Um, but I think at some point, and by the way, I think she's heading down a road. You know, I know she's like mixed. So, so I don't know. So maybe her people deal with it different. I haven't really heard about her family or ever like commented about her. But she looks like somebody, you know how they did to Britney Spears? where, like, there was a conservatorship, which means Britney Spears literally couldn't do anything without the approval of someone else in her family because they felt like she was mentally unfit. I think Doja Cat's heading that, that, down that, that room. So, I don't know. Somebody says she got fucked by who? She's losing fans doing all this type of stuff? I can't tell if she's losing fans. I think her fan page is deactivated, then activated back again. I do think that she definitely has a lack of appreciation for the success and the blessings that God has given her through her fans and support. And it's, it's a dangerous type of game when people just act entitled, especially act entitled to even talk to or do anything when it comes to your, 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 even your own personal fan base. 
And um, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm wondering how this is going to turn out. Somebody said, ever since French Montana fucked the shit out of her, she ain't been the same? Really? I got I to gotta, I gotta hit up French. Maybe he did fuck her. I don't know. Somebody said, you're waiting for Doja Cat to come out as trans? I can see that. She's an industry puppet. I'm going to be honest with you, though, and, and, and this is the last thing I'll say about it. What I hope doesn't happen is that I hope she doesn't crash out on some Amy Whitehouse stuff. And what I mean by that is she has some issue that is exacerbated by her fame and that ends up consuming her and ends up, you know, you know, we, we don't want to wake up and she's on TMZ ever. Right. Especially with some stuff like that. So I hope I'm wrong. I'm hoping that maybe this is a weird marketing thing. I'm hoping mentally she's good. I'm hoping she's not um, like just depressed. I'm hoping that she's not on any drugs, but I'm going to be honest with you. It's kind of hard to fucking get her drift because I can't get it. Evan Almighty, man. So what up, Ak? Much love from Houston, Texas. Yo, Evan, man, you got to pull up to, uh, yo, hey, again, September 10th, we're having an event. I need everybody to cop some tickets, man. Please. Uh, we're trying to get this shit sold out, so please make sure you buy your tickets. We, we've added a couple incentives. Uh, you can come to the uh, the soft launch, or actually the official launch of uh, the uh, our Dialect Studios, which is a part of the Academy. See where we kind of film off the record. See, like, the infamous spot where everything kind of goes down. And, um, yeah, there's a meet and greet associated with it and, like, some VIP other stuff with it. Okay, so please, if you are in the New York City area... Um, the location of it is in Jersey City, but it's literally five or ten minutes from New York City. So if you're in Connecticut, just take that drive down. If you're in um, Philadelphia, just take that drive up. All right? Okay. Let me see. What is this? Ah, bet. Uh, okay. Um, what the fuck is this? All right, what topics didn't I cover? Oh, we got some more from Meg's statements. What the hell? Oh, shit. Meg hate that fucking...